One out of five said there are six million voters in Kano. He forgot that he was about one million Baba Chala world. Welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channels. To get notified when we post our GC news update, please click on the notification bell. According to a video that was published by the channel television and Twitter yesterday night, it could be seen that the former secretary to the government of the Federation of Nigeria, Baba Chalawal, who is a diehard supporter of PTOB's presidential ambition, has revealed the chances the Liberal Party has in the northern part of the country. While he was talking during the interview with a channel television correspondent, Baba Chalawal said that Erufai's statement where the letter claimed that some states where the letter claimed that some states in the north, especially Kano and Kaduna and others, are enough to wipe out the entire strongholds of the Liberal Party's presidential candidate in this forthcoming election. Baba Chalawal, when reacting to this, said, When Erufai said that 6 million voters in Kano, he forgot that Igbo is about 1 million. It is a mistake to say that 6 million registered voters in Lagos are all Yoruba. They are not. It comprises of Ibo, Hausa, Ibibio, Kanri people, and so on. Further speaking, he said due to the insecurity and other problems the ruling party has created for Nigerians, people could not travel to their hometowns and villages to register for PVC. But instead, they registered, they registered rather in their states of residence, as alleged that this factor will also play out this time around, especially Igbo people in Kanu who could not go home. Now, this is what I'm going to say. You see that that's error that they always say the southeastern region has the smallest population. Da 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 da. da. You know all those things. Mm -mm. This time around, I feel people fail to understand. Mm -hmm. They fail to understand that. They fail to understand that this this particular and uh, what's it called? This particular election. Let me even use this one. This election is different. Even before even this election, previous elections, Igbo's people are always accused that why not they stay for in the house? Why not they stay for their state? Igbo's are everywhere. Yes. The same way you cannot say the whole of Kano is made up of only Kano people. It's not possible. These people are they are scattered all over the permit me to use the word scattered. They are almost every all over the country. In places like Lagos, you see at you see Ibo. even this Kano, Kano is popularly not, they have a place you go to now that you know you that they, they have where these people stay. So if you are saying the one the population in the south is small, don't forget that the one in this in the north in the north east in the north central in this on some places, hope you're not excluding those ones as well. And Baba Chelawal is actually have a right. Okay, and we will all be happy if a woman becomes president. It's to show equality of every tribe. Thank you, my brother. Your epitome is the pristine ethos of a tribun or Malabi who understand that the underpinning pivot of equity is equality. After all, what is source for the Igbos? What is source for the good is also source for the Ganda. And the thing is, forget about Igbo presidency or not. Now, politicians not cost this wala, first of all. You know why? They go in and they don't perform well. I have said it that do you know that if somebody becomes the president, the governor, the state, uh, what's it called, the legislator, the senator, house of assembly member, you know, and all of that. If that person becomes these things and do not perform well, that is when we have all those problems and crisis. Do you understand? That is when we have all this plenty, plenty problem and crisis. Had it been... Whether you're an Igbo, whether you're a Yoruba, you see the Fulanese, most especially, the Northerners, most especially, the Southerners who have been in power, have been performing well. It is not, if you want to come as who will even ask you? People who are going to even come as and be complained, they'll be telling the, there will be plenty of people who will shut them down. So, God, what thing will they talk for? What they won't complain for? Share, you know, they, share what, in fact, people, not, the people, as in the person who's trying to then go, go hush the person, say, close your mouth. But it is because these people are not performing well. They go into government, they don't do what they're supposed to do. They take all our resources, they waste our resources. And then, you know, that is why somebody will come say, after all, this person is not, is not even from, is not even from my tribe, safe go. Make person from my tribe can't try them now. That is it. If we all have in Nigeria a system that is working for everyone, we are not going to have people coming out to tell us, this one are Igbos, this one not be Igbos. And that is true. Okay, 
We will all know his fears. That is why he's trying to use propaganda to cover. I bet you P2B will shock a refined Cardona. So for you to come out and for those who are always saying and it was a small, yeah, it's only nothing, but it's only one local government in nothing, in nothing Nigeria will cover one. I just make a remind them all. So these people, plenty of them all, they know they will. They know they for us. In fact, the Igbos are known for not staying in the ass. That is why, if you see where they are talking, they'll say, What thing keep you here? Why are you not go go your place? You waste that year. What did they do? Do you understand? They're always telling them go back home. So, those ones wait day outside their homeland. Now, make you no know, go think, say, you know, I hope so those ones, you know, count them, join Kano people, or count them, join Lagos people. I just make you. This is just a reminder. All right. Um... Apart from that, all the normal Nigerians inside the 6 million in Kano will vote P2B of Labour Party for a change. People do not want bad government to get in Nigeria, and it is only P2B of Labour Party that can do a positive change. Okay? Correct me, but I refuse to be suffering and smiling. Like it turned Anambra into New London Abbey, you people should check your leaking brains. My dear, the thing is, I don't understand why people are using the Anambra state of now to... What is happening? And I don't know why you people are attributing the Lagos state of now to when Tinobu. Tinobu came out of Lagos. For goodness sake, he left office 2007. If you even want to compare Lagos, please compare Lagos 2007 with Peter B's 2007 in I mean, with, with Peter B's um, really number state of 2007. That is when you can compare. You can't come out now and use Lagos state today to compare and telling me, no, 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 no. Use that... Tunable Road for eight years, 1999 to 2007. Do you understand? And then use P2B's 1997 ruling and compare. You're coming out to even compare obese. A lot of things have gone wrong. Even in southeastern region, somebody that ruled last year. Somebody that's ruled last year. Let me say, for instance, Willie Ob as in Willie Obiano, the governor of Anambra State, former governor. Hmm? What did he do last year and his state as in? The thing is when they see for now, they do not see when in the room. I do, do you understand? <laughs> so you can't come outside to judge like that. So it was almost 1 million in Kano. Very good. More than 1 million. And in Lagos, half of the votes in votes belongs to the Igbos. Will be have the highest chance of winning this election. Make sure they calm down. No? Make sure they calm down. Hmm? Make sure they calm down. <laughs> okay. All the states in Nigeria, Igbo means their population. Continue to deceive yourself with your a nonsensical statistic population census in nigeria is a fraud election the fraud state creation a fraud <laughs> nigeria and so the body for in a court then i know when i go pick and go all right on this note you've come to the end of the news we say thank you for tuning in to listen until i come your way next time enjoy the rest of your day <laughs>